This is the Orange Level 2 Tape Side 1. These orange tapes will help you learn sound combinations that come at the beginning of words. And when you learn all these sound combinations, you'll be ready for the Orange Workbook. Can you imagine that? Just by learning what's on these tapes, you'll be well on your way to becoming the best reader you can be. Do you have the orange flashcards handy? If not, stop the tape and take them out of the orange box. When you're ready with the flashcards, they're the ones with the orange border and the hole for the white ring. Press the play button to start the tape again. Push the stop button now. Okay now, are you ready to begin? Now, pick up the orange deck of flashcards. Hold the deck in your hand with CH facing you. The orange cards are numbered 1, 2, and 3. The letter names the sound they make and a word to read, you see? Let's read these cards together and learn them inside out. Concentrate on the letter sounds, that's what reading's all about. I'll say CH. Ch chin is what we'll say. Then place CH behind. TH is on the way. Orange cards, ready? One, two, three, go. CH. Ch chin. TH. Thin. S H. Sh ship. W H. Wh when. T H. Th that. S M. Sm smell. S N. Sn snap. S P. Bin. S L Sl Slam S C Sk Scat S K Sk Skip S W Sw Swim S T St Stop Your card should be in order, with CH on top. If something's wrong or messed up, push that button stop. Let's do it again. You say what you heard. Read the letters, sound, and then the word. Orange cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. CH. Chin. TH. Thin. SH. Sh ship. WH. When. TH. That. SM. Sm smell. SN. Snap SP Sp Spin SL Sl Slam SC Sk Scat SK Sk Skip SW Sw Swim S-T St Stop Do it again! Say what you heard, read the letters, sound, and then the word. Orange cards. Ready? One, two, three, go! C-H Ch Chin TH thin SH ship WH 
br. When. Th. <laughs> that. Sm. Sm. Smell. Sn. Sn. Snap. Sp. Sp. Spin. Sl. Sl. Slam. Sc. Sk. Scat. Sk. Sk. Skip. Sw. Sw. Swim. St. St. Stop. One more time. As you heard, read the letters, sound, and then the word. Orange cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. C H. Ch. Chin. T H. Th. Thin. S H. Sh. Ship. W H. When. T H. That. S M. Sm. Smell. S N. Sn. Snap. S P. Sp. Spin. S L. Sl. Slam. S C. Sk. Scat. S K. Sk. Skip. S W. Sw. Swim. S T. St. Stop. Let's read these cards together and learn them inside out. Concentrate on the letter sounds. That's what reading's all about. This time when we do it, reading out loud as we go. Cover the word with your thumb to see how much you know. I'll say the letter names and you say the sound. Listen to me to see if you're right now another time around. Orange cards, ready? One, two, three, go. C-H. Ch. T-H. S-H. Sh. W-H. W T H V S M S M S N S N S P S P S L S L S C S K S K S W S W S T S T Let's do it again and do it the same. Cover the word that's part of the game. Orange cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. C H Ch T H S H Sh W H W T H S M S M 
S N S N S P S P S L S L S C S K S K S K S W S W S T How did you do? If you know these new sounds inside out, that means if you know all these sound combinations without guessing, you're ready to move on. But if not, rewind the tape and go through them again. Never move on to a new lesson until you know the old lesson inside out. This is so important. Take your time. There's no hurry. Have fun and learn at your own speed. You can do it. Stop the tape if you want to rewind it and go through these new sounds again. Then press the play button when you're ready to go on. Push the stop button now. This is the end of the orange tape side one. Now fast forward this tape to the end. Then turn it over and listen to side two. I'll meet you there. This is the orange tape side two. This tape will take us through the first half of the orange workbook together. Parents, although this tape walks through each lesson, it's important for you to be there to guide and encourage your child. This tape will help you help your child work through each lesson. Well, do you know all the new sounds on side one of the orange flashcards inside out? Do you know them without guessing? If you do, then you're ready to move on. But if you're not sure you're sure of them, why not go through them one more time without my help? Knowing the new sounds inside out is so important for learning to read. Remember, there's no hurry, and with a little more practice, you'll be on your way. Do you want to practice? Stop the tape, then press the play button to start the tape again when you're ready for the orange workbook. Push the stop button now. Are you ready? Put the orange flashcards away in the orange box for now. You'll need them later. I'll tell you when. Now get the orange workbook and open it to page four. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're ready to start. Push the stop button now. Do you have the orange workbook open to page four? This is the first sounding out words page in this workbook. Let's sound out and read all the words on page four together. We're going to start with the top of the page. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide your finger over to the first word, Chad, and let's read across the line out loud together. Chad, slide. Chap, slide. Chat, slide. Chin, slide. Chill. Slide. Chip. Now let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word chick and read out loud with me. Ready? Chick. Slide. Chop. Slide. Chug. Slide. Chum. Slide. Chuck. Slide. Chess. Let's read line three. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number three and read out loud with me. Slide. Check. Now let's read the bottom of the page together. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide your finger over to the first word thin, and let's read across the line out loud together. Thin. Slide, thick, slide, thud. Now let's read the next page, page five. This is a review page. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide over to the word Chad 
and read out loud with me. Ready? Chad. Slide. Chap. Slide. Chat. Slide. Chin. Slide. Chill. Slide. Chip. Good. Let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word chick and read with me. Chick. Slide. Chop. Slide. Chum. Slide. Chuck. Slide. Chess. Slide. Check. Now line three. Is your finger on the arrow next to the number three? Slide to the word thin. Ready? Thin. Slide. Thick. Slide. Thud. Now that we've read pages four and five together, I want you to go back and read these two pages over again. But this time, I want you to read without my help. So go back to the top of page four, slide over to the word Chad, and then, by yourself, read all the words across lines one, two, and three. When you finish reading the top of page four, read the bottom of the page. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading page four. Push the stop button now. Finished reading page four? Now read page five all by yourself, just the way we did it together. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're ready to go on. Push the stop button now. Turn to page six. You're ready for the first story in the orange workbook. It's called Matt and Tom. Read this story out loud all by yourself. Then we'll read the story a second time together. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished reading the story. Push the stop button now. Did you like the story? Now let's read it together. Matt and Tom. Matt and Tom are pals. Tom chops with an ax, but Matt chats. Do not chat, Matt says. Tom, we need to chop. Okay, says Matt. Let's chop. Matt and Tom chop the logs. Whap, bam, we did it. Now Matt and Tom can chat. One more time now. Read it again, okay? You won't need me for this. And then you can read the story to your family and to your friends and show them what you can do. Just stop the tape. Then, when you've read the story a few times, press the play button to start the tape again. Remember to place a sticker on your My Reading Adventure poster when you're finished. Push the stop button now. Now let's learn some more words. Let's read the next sounding out words page, page eight. Are you ready? Let's sound out and read all the words on page eight together. Now place your finger on the arrow next to the number one on the top of the page. Slide your finger over to the first word, shall, and let's read across the line out loud together. Shall, slide, shag, slide, shack, slide, ship, slide, shin, slide. Shop. Now let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word shot and read out loud with me. Ready? Let's go. Shot. Slide. Shock. Slide. Shut. Slide. Shed. Slide. Shell. Now let's sound out and read the words on the bottom of the page. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide your finger over to the first word, whip, and let's read across the line out loud together. 
whip, slide, whiz, slide, whiff, slide, whim, slide, when. Good. Now read the review page on your own. Stop the tape. Then, when you're finished reading page nine, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Do you have a pencil or a crayon handy? If not, stop the tape and get one, and we can have fun with this review page. Press the play button when you're ready. Push the stop button now. Are you ready? Now, can you find all the words that start with the s sound? Draw a circle around each of them. Read the words out loud. Stop the tape. Then, when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around thin, thick, and thud? Good. Now here's a puzzle for you. Find two words on this page that mean things you might find at the ocean. Draw a box around them. Then read them out loud. Stop the tape. Then, when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around ship on line one and shell on line two? Good. Now go back and read pages eight and nine over again for practice all by yourself. So go back to the top of page eight and then all by yourself read all the words across lines one and two. When you finish reading the top of page eight, read the bottom of the page. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading page eight. Push the stop button now. Finished reading page eight. Now read page nine again. Read it all by yourself. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading page nine. Push the stop button now. Let's turn to page ten, the next sounding out words page. From now on, we're going to read just the sounding out words pages together. Each time we finish one, I want you to stop the tape and read the following review page all by yourself. Then read both the sounding out words page and the review page again without my help. Let's try it now with pages ten and eleven. Page ten. Let's read out loud together. Line one. That, than, this, them, then. Stop the tape. Then, when you're finished reading review page eleven all by yourself, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Now it's your turn to read pages ten and eleven on your own. When you're finished reading them, press the play button again. Push the stop button now. Turn to page twelve. Here's a new story. This one's called "Can You Get Sam to the Ship?" It's a story and a game. Read it without my help. Use your finger to trace the path while you read the words on the signs out loud. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading the story a few times. Push the stop button now. Read the story one more time. Read it all by yourself without my help. Then you can read it to your friends and show them how to play the game. When you've read the story a few times, press the play button to start the tape again. Push the stop button now. Turn to page fifteen. Page fifteen is the first word play page in the Orange Workbook. Remember how word play goes. Take the black and white word play cards out of the card pouch in the orange box. Next, with the help of someone in your family or a friend, follow the step-by-step -step instructions on the page. Stop the tape, and when you're finished playing word play, press the play button. Push the stop button now. You don't have to hurry along, you know. You can go as fast or as slowly as you like. Would you like to go back and read your favorite workbook story or hot book again now? When you're ready to move on, I'll be right here waiting for you. If you want to take a break, push the stop button now. 
If you're ready to move on, turn to page 16. It's time to learn more new sounds. Remember, we're going to read just the sounding out words pages together. When we're finished with this sounding out words page, I want you to stop the tape and read the following review page all by yourself. Let's try the top of the page now. Line 1. Smack. Smog. Smock. Smug. Smell. Let's read the bottom of the page out loud together. Line 1. Snap. Snag. Snack. Snip. Sniff. Snug. Now line 2. Snub. Snuck. Go ahead and read page 17 on your own. Stop the tape. Then when you're ready for more, press the play button again. Push the stop button now. Let's have fun with this review page. Draw a circle around the two words that start with the f sound. F. Read those words out loud. Stop the tape. Then press the play button again when you're ready to go on. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around whiff and when on line four? Good. Now here's a puzzle for you. Can you find the two words that mean things you use your nose for? Here's a hint. One word is on line one and the other is on line two. Draw a box around them. Read them out loud. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished with page 17, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around smell on line one and sniff on line two? Good. Now, when you're finished reading pages 16 and 17 again by yourself, press the play button. Push the stop button now. This is Sounding Out Words, page 18. Let's read out loud together. Line 1 on the top of the page. Span. Spin. Spill. Spit. Spot. Spun. Line 2. Sped. Spell. Let's read the bottom of the page out loud together. Line 1. Slam. Slab. Slap. Slacks. Slid. Slim. Line 2. Slip. Slit. Slick. Slot. Slug. Sled. Stop the tape and read the words on review page 19 without my help. When you're finished reading page 19, press the play button again. Push the stop button now. It's time for another story, so turn to page 20. This one is called The Sled. Read the story out loud, have fun, and when you're done, read it again to your family and friends. When you've read the story a few times, press the play button. Push the stop button now. We're up to page 22 now. How far you've come! These are the first helper word ladders in the orange workbook. Do you remember helper words? They help you to read. They're words that are used a lot in books and many of these words cannot be sounded out. The new helper words are always on ladder one, and there are always helper words to practice on helper word ladders two, three, and four. First, let's climb up ladder one together. Remember to reach for the star. Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Come, read it with me. Come. Now slide your finger up the ladder to the next helper word. 
down, down, slide up, thank, thank. You've reached the star. Let's climb ladder one again together. Ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Come, slide, down, slide, thank. You've reached the star. Once again, ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Come, slide, down, slide, thank. You've reached the star. Now place your finger on the arrow above the number two. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Need, slide, where, slide, look, slide, game. You've reached the star. Place your finger on the arrow above the number three. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. My slide, of slide, for slide, want. You've reached the star. Now place your finger on the arrow above the number four. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Now slide, play, slide, me. You've reached the star. Now stop the tape and practice all the helper words on this page without my help. Read them up and down and down and up and jump from one ladder to another ladder for fun. When you're finished practicing, press the play button. Push the stop button now. It's time for pile up. Do you remember how to play? Take helper word cards 19 through 34 out of the card pouch in the orange box. You'll also want to add any cards from level one that you still need to practice. Stop the tape. Then when you're ready, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Okay now, your parent or a friend will show you one card at a time. Try to read the word on each card out loud. Whenever you read the word correctly, you get to keep the card. And if you miss a word, give it a second try. If you miss it again, go on to the next card. Watch the pile of cards grow as you learn these words. When you're finished playing pile up, the cards go back in the card pouch to save them for next time. Stop the tape. And when you're finished playing the game, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 23 now and you'll see that you're ready to read another story. This story is called Sam Did It. What do you think Sam did? Read the story out loud and find out. Have fun. And when you're done, read it again to your family and friends. When you've read the story a few times, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Another story. The story on page 24 is really a letter called, Thank you, Mom. Read this one out loud too. Have fun. And when you're done, read it again. When you've read the story a few times out loud, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Can you believe it? You've just read two new stories. And here comes the first hop book of this level. Go ahead and get hop book 15 out of the orange box. It's a slam and dunk book, all about the adventures of two friends named Slam and Dunk. This book is called Slam and Dunk and the Big Game. Read it out loud. Have fun with it. And when you're done, read the book again to your family and friends. After you've read the book a few times, press the play button. Remember to place a sticker on your My Reading Adventure poster when you're finished. Parents, it's important to help your child think about ideas in the story while reading. Each time your child reads a hot book, take some time to talk about it. You can use the questions on this page or make up your own questions to help your child understand the book. Push the stop button now. Are you back in the orange workbook with me? Now let's read a sounding out words page, page 26. Are you ready? 
Let's read out loud together. Line one on the top of the page. Scat. Scab. Scan. Scott. Scuff. Let's read the bottom of the page out loud together. Line one. Skip. Skid. Skill. Skim. Skin. Skit. Line two. Skull. Stop the tape and read the words on the review page all by yourself. When you're finished reading page 27, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Let's have some fun with this review page. Draw a circle around the two words that begin with the sp sound. Sp. Read them both out loud. When you're finished, just press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around span and spun? Good! Now, can you find the boy's name on this page? Draw a box around it, then read it out loud. Stop the tape, and when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around Scott on line one? Good! Remember to read the Sounding Out Words page and review page again all by yourself. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished practicing pages 26 and 27, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Here's Sounding Out Words page 28. Let's read out loud together. Line 1 on the top of the page. Swam. Swim. Swiss. Swum. Swell. Line one on the bottom of the page. Staff. Stab. Stag. Stan. Stack. Stiff. Line two. Still. Stick. Stop. Stock. Stub. Stuff. Line three. Stun. Stuck. Stem. Step. Remember to read the review page without my help. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished reading page 29, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Now remember to read pages 28 and 29 again for practice. Then you can press the play button again. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 30. Now here's a new story. This one's called The Pals. It's a story and a game. Try reading it out loud by yourself. Then read it again for practice and for fun. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading the story a few times. Push the stop button now. Now turn to page 32. Do you remember how to play word play? First take the black and white word play cards out of the card pouch in the orange box. Next, with the help of someone in your family or a friend, follow the step-by-step -step instructions on the page. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished playing word play, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 33, the first workbook review in the orange workbook. Workbook reviews help you practice many of the words you've learned so far. And you have learned a lot of words. There's no hurry. You can do it. When you're finished reading page 33, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Let's have some fun with this workbook review. Draw a circle around all of the words that begin with the sk sound. Sk. Be careful. Don't get tricked. Read all those words out loud. Stop the tape. Then when you're ready to go on, press the play button. Push the stop button now. 
Did you draw a circle around skit on line one, scuff and scan on line two, and skim on line three? That's right. Not all the words that begin with the sk sound start with the same two letters. Remember, some words start with the letters SC and some words start with the letters SK. Now, if you know these words inside out, you're ready to move on. But if you're guessing at some of the words, rewind the tape and repeat any of the lessons that you're not sure you know. Never move on to a new lesson until you know the old ones inside out. Stop the tape. Then, when you're ready to go on again, press the play button. Push the stop button now. We're up to page 34 now. Here are more helper word ladders. Let's climb the helper word ladders together. First, we'll climb up ladder one together. Remember to reach for the stars. Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word, ask. Read it with me, ask. Now slide your finger up the ladder to the next helper word, from, from. Slide up. Go, go, slide up, say, say, you've reached the star. Let's climb ladder one again together. Ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word, ask, slide, from, slide, go, slide, Say, you've reached the star. Once again, ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide, ask, slide, from, slide, go, slide, say, you've reached the star. Now, ladder two, thank. Slide, game, slide, of, slide, now. Ladder three, come, slide, want, slide, play, slide, need. Ladder four, me, slide, four, slide. Down. One more time. Go back and climb these helper word ladders again without my help. After you're finished, press the play button. Ready to practice? Push the stop button now. Don't forget to play pile up after practicing the words on the helper word ladders. Take helper word cards 23 through 38 out of the card pouch. Next, with the help of someone in your family or a friend, play pile up. You can pile up a lot of cards now. When you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 35. It's time for another story. This one's called Let's Go. It's a story and a game. Read it out loud. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished reading the story a few times. Push the stop button now. Wow, another story. It's called, Where is my ham? Turn to page 36 and read it out loud. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished reading this story a few times. Push the stop button now. We're at page 37. Get Hot Book 16 out of the orange box. It's another slam and dunk book. It's called Slam and Dunk Go to the Moon. Read it out loud. Have fun with it. And when you're done, read the book again to your family and friends. After you've read the book a few times, press the play button. Parents, each time your child reads a hot book, take some time to talk about it. You can use the questions listed on this page or make up your own questions to help your child understand the book. Push the stop button now. This is the end of the orange tape side two. Stop this tape and remove it from your cassette player. 
Then insert the orange tape side 3 and press the play button. I'll meet you there. Push the stop button now.